Friends, they are at it again. Once again, Republicans have turned their backs on middle class Americans and instead are focused on restricting the rights of women. When I speak with women in my district, they're concerned about finding a job, keeping their home from foreclosure, affording college for their children, or putting food on the table. What they do not ask for is their constitutional rights to be threatened or their health to be endangered. Yet the most recent bill brought to the floor by Republicans in Congress does just that. Rather than focus on continuing to rebuild our nation's economy, once again, Republicans are seeking to limit women's access to reproductive care. I'm particularly troubled that the Protect Life Act actually does just the opposite, endangering the lives of women. The Protect Life Act would override core patient protections and allow hospitals to legally refuse life-saving treatment to women, thus allowing them to die in a hospital despite their treatable condition. This extreme legislation is dangerous to women's health and does nothing to address the jobs crisis facing American families. If Republicans truly want to protect life, they should work with Democrats to improve the economy, create jobs, and make everyone's life better.